President Biden, President Trump, President Obama, President Bush. These are letters to my presidents. Letters to my presidents. That's Get Shorty. All right, that's Get Shorty. That's President Obama and Kwaisi and Fume and Governor O'Malley. You made Governor O'Malley head of Social Security. Well, we got a problem with that. Governor O'Malley's a crook. Just like D.C. Stevenson from the 1920s. I'm blowing the whistle on Governor O'Malley and his crime machine. Sheila Dixon, the Welches. Welch had a, a 99th birthday party. Everybody that was in that picture is part of this corruption machine. They will congratulate a person doing the same thing as you, just not you, just because it's you. I applied for Martin Luther King's job in 2011, and y'all locked me up. February the 2nd, 2011, my mother died from cancer. February the 6th, 2011, I applied for Martin Luther King's job, exposing the prison industry and the money you make off black bodies. Adam May did an hour and a half interview of me. Y'all need to play that whole hour and a half interview. You feel me? That's Eric Barron, whistleblower submission. It's been too long and 12 years a slave. I've been 12 years a slave. It was all about Anthony Brown, Governor O'Malley's mom machine, the prison industry, the money you make. I made a movie about it. Now I'm ready to put it in production, but I need a court case. I need a trial. I never got a trial. Just like Dred Scott, do blacks have rights in which white America respects? I went from Baltimore's worst to Baltimore's best. Shorty Davis, all right, Weaver Award, citywide. Dwayne has been building community in Baltimore for over 20 years and is passionate about bringing people together, getting them to think about things, new ways and ideas, and talking to them with good food. Dwayne will use this award to support the good in the hood, which will bring people together, family-friendly events, connect, share food, ideas, and strengthen communities, all right? I also use the money to make this book, Baltimore Rewired. I'm gonna make this book into a movie. And I got two copies of this. Like I said, that's Peter Francott. And that's me, I'm a mentor. We talking about voter suppression, $250 million in intellectual property theft. $250 million in intellectual property theft. That's Commissioner Batts, Councilman Brandon Scott, Councilman Branch, Councilman Coran. Councilman Brandon Scott had this. Mayor Stephanie Rollins Blake had that. And that's the Department of Justice ID number. You got a federal investigation. Shorty, pull your mask up? No, you got a federal investigation coming. And you part of it. You in the middle of it. You are gonna snitch. Cause like I said, you had this information when you were councilman. Now you're the mayor and you got the book. Those are the criminal charges. Like I said, I'm weaving in Baltimore. I'm weaving in Baltimore. That's M&T Bank and weaving, all right? That's me. Y'all made me famous for toilets. I'll see you hot it. Bitch, nice and shot it. You better hot it before I find it. It was art and activism, the art of protest. And this is me, 2011. It's 9-11 today. I went to trial today. I went to trial today in 2011. I won my trial. I was found innocent. So I put it in a book, Brown Omen 2014. You see that? That's 2014. That's Delegate GOP Carter. See the date? 2014. You feel me? 2014. October 2nd, 2014. And I still ain't got justice. That's the Department of Justice. And that's Rod Rosenstein. Like I said, President Biden, it's 9-11. Do blacks have rights in which white America respects? Because I want my freedom. That's Shorty. That's the book, Dred Scott. That's Shorty, I'm still standing. You feel me? I'm still standing. And that's Mayor Sheila Dixon. Cause like I said, book, movie, lawsuit. And Sheila Dixon, you've been protecting white supremacy. You feel me? When you got jammed up, they gave you a pass. You didn't go to jail. You feel me? They gave you a pass. I went to jail for something I didn't do. You didn't go to jail and you did something. You feel me? That's Brooke Learman. I need a federal and state audit. I'm out $250 million. Corey McRae, Bill Ferguson, you're representatives. You feel me? Just like you're the representative. Taxation without representation is a violation of my constitutional rights. See that? No taxes were paid. If Trump is going to jail for tax in income tax evasion and fraud, 
Yeah, I want the same justice you're giving Donald Trump. I want a grand jury. I want those 52 members of the Democratic Party held accountable. You feel me? I got a right to film the police. I'm not the clown around town. But just like Martin, it's the good kind of trouble. I go to jail for the right reasons. Right here. That's the Department of Justice, me, and Martin Luther King. I'm innocent. I want what belongs to me. I don't get no justice. You don't get no peace.